ban, marry, kill. Yeah. N- Nicholas Cage, Steve Buscemi, and uh, Jason Statham. Uh wow. Okay. Married Steve Buscemi. Fuck. Uh, Jason Statham? No. No? Nicholas Cage? Yeah. That's what that's what Jason Statham. That's that's what I'm saying. Like I think I think it makes it's quite a tricky one. Because imagine trying to kill Jason Statham. That's true. But then on top of that, imagine trying to kill Nicholas Cage. You'd like cave your head in with like crazy. He is. <laughs> ma- Do you know he named his son after Superman? Yeah. Weird. Poor guy. But like, not even like Clark. He was, he was like Kal El. <laughs> uh. That reminds me of the time when I was younger. No, I haven't got anything. <laughs> <laughs> Back in my day. Although I do have a story about Superman, but it doesn't really relate well for this part. Just go for it, though. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Oh no, it's just, it's quite a sad story actually. Oh. Oh. Just, uh, someone broke my Superman toy. And they like snapped the arms off it. Oh shit. They beat him up after that. <laughs> Pushed me over the edge. <laughs> so yeah. What a nice opening. What a great <laughs> opening. The two damn cousins out, they watch a movie. Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Reinventing the Real. This week, no sticks, I know I said that last time as well, doesn't really make sense, but where what? It's just a regular random episode, just I, yeah. as real as it can get. Oh, I like that, that's wordplay. I'm a fan of when we, is... when we very much go off the cuff, oh shoot, when we very much go off the cuff. Oh, yeah, because I don't know what we're gonna get. You know, the listeners exactly. Well, I mean, they know they know what film we're doing because you know they're reading it in the title. But yeah, yeah. Um, but for these first couple of minutes, it's all the unknown for us. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm kind of hoping we get us like something that's slightly more serious again because I really enjoyed last week. Yeah, well, you never know. I mean, we've added. Just a little bit of behind the scenes stuff here. We've added a few more films to our film list of that we're gonna randomize up. And some game some more game changers, which are different and you know, because I feel like a lot of the time we've been, just been hitting the same sort of stuff. Yeah. On the on the random game changers. Now yeah. there's a few yeah, there's a few uh similar ones in there to what we've got, but they're different enough to make it like its own thing. So I guess without further ado, I think it's time. You know what to do. All right, here we go. Spin, Spin that, that reel. If I'm doing this, I should probably practice how to. <laughs> okay. Um, what we got? Okay, so uh, we got a. Uh, a film that came out in 2008. Okay. Yeah. Um, spawned a, a, very, a very popular franchise. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I know what this is. And um, Is it Twilight? Yeah. We, we got oh Twilight. Oh boy. Um, I, <laughs> I, let, me, let me ask you this before we go on. Team Edward or Team Jacob? Um... I'm team Bella's dad, actually. Bella's dad is the most underrated c- character in those films. Charlie is the yeah. best. He, he gets a lot of flack. Like, in the... Is it, it's the second one, and she keeps waking up in the middle of the night, like, screaming and shit. And he just comes in, he's like, it's okay, dear. And just takes care of her, you know? <laughs> That's what a dad's yeah. supposed to do. I mean, actually, I, I, I wouldn't know. But he seems like a good dad. 
too real. God damn. <laughs> too real. <laughs> okay. Okay, I, I like that though. I think we can work with that. Yeah. So, episode nine. Here we go. So, if we go to the to the next random wheel here, Cameron, let's hear it. Spin, Spin that, that reel. reel. Okay, so we got must make for film rated R. Okay. 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 So I'm thinking we can either uh, probably more with the violence or like, yeah. <laughs> okay. Do two more. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got have to make it into a TLC show. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So just for vo- like, uh, think like. Here comes Honey Boo Boo, Ninety Day Fiance, uh, Extreme Cheapskates, but v- those kind of yeah, yeah, and the final one. <laughs> I've already got an idea. Fuck. It has to have a lot of product placement. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And then let me add in the. All the different brands we have here. <laughs> and the product placement that we're going for this week is... Raid Shadow Legends! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Sounds good. Raid Shadow. So, uh, did you want to do anything with actors or anything, or hit, hit me? Uh, what, what were you thinking? Because I feel like you've really got part of an idea. Yeah. Okay. So it has to be a TLC show. Yeah. So already I'm thinking. Uh, my husband is a vampire or something, or yeah, like like a real like. Uh, it's sort of on the side of 90 day fiance where they meet up like they met online or something and then like regular people meeting up with their a cult is that the right word a cult lover yeah yeah so like it would be yeah, yeah, I, bella yeah. meets uh edward i was about to call him daniel yeah edward yeah you know what let's call him daniel Fuck's daniel He's daniel and our one <laughs> <laughs> sure all right <laughs> so uh uh, yeah, so she's meeting a vampire. Then you've got some other girl meeting a werewolf, and yeah. or like a maybe we could make the woman a werewolf in this. Okay, you never know. And uh, yeah, so it's like a week to week. Yeah, and like every every week there's episode. like there's like two kind of stories going on or something like that. Yeah, yeah. So like it'll cut maybe between the more. two. It'll be like this week we check in on uh, on Bella and Daniel. Yeah, yeah. I and because we have to make it rated R, I think there should be I I, I had an there's idea. like murders in the town or whatever. Yeah, and the camera crew's like following it, and <laughs> the second obviously week in people a row think it's the camera crew. <laughs> yeah, I mean, well, it's TLC in it. Yeah, what else can you do with them? Um. They're like, hmm. I, I is have... the vampire guy killing people? Is the yeah. werewolf, or is it the humans? <gasps> yeah. Find out this week on TLC's Twilight. I was thinking, what if we have it like, kind of like a like a freaky is element to it as well. Oh, and like okay. you know, like when they're like, they open up a truck and they're like, you see this? You see all these ice cream sticks? This is how much ice cream you eat in a year, and then the person's like, "Oh my yeah. god, I had no idea it was this bad." Oh. So like they open up a truck, so it's like, and it's just like dead bodies and flies and blood. shit. Yeah. 
and they're just like, you see <laughs> this? This is the amount of blood you drink every year. This is how many humans worth it is. And it just cuts to David. He's like, I, I had uh, Daniel, David, Daniel. He's like, Daniel. he's like, oh, I, I had no clue. I was getting through this much. Like, it, it really makes me want to take a, a, another look at my life. You know, who wh- I used mm. to love art and blah blah blah. You know, <laughs> now look at me. I'm I'm drinking eight kids a day. <laughs> so are we going so, for more like a right. like a sad angle or like a you know like how most TLC shows are funny? Are we going more that kind of route? Yeah, I mean, it's sort of like it's sad for the the people on the show, but like <laughs> it's sad for the for viewer, the people, it's just yeah. like yeah, for for the viewer, it's like haha, look at their lives. So oh, that would never be me, sort of thing. It's like when you watch what? like super size, super skinny when you're eating food, and you're like, oh, what are they? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at that fat cunt. <laughs> Scranning some fucking Doritos or some shit. Playing Raid Shadow Legends on your phone <laughs> while you're watching it. <laughs> uh, so, so if we have these two plot lines then. So, mm. Oh, so, okay, so what if it's following... What if it's like a dating show? Yeah. And it's following Bella, who's the one who's trying to go and date... And it shows her like go on like free dates maybe. So there's like a, a random dickhead who let's make him like a mm-hmm. like a like a Wendigo or something like that. And then you have um Edward and then you have Jacob as well. Or, or something like that. Oh sorry, Daniel and Jacob. <laughs> um and then like by the end of the show of the sh- show she has to figure she has to be like, Oh, I'm gonna choose this man I wanna be with or something like that. Okay, yeah. But at the same time, there's also murders going on in the town. And like you said, they don't know who yeah. it is. Because yes, the blood is right. gone. But the blood is not like disappeared. Like there's blood all over the scene. And yeah. they're very animalistic attacks. So it could be a werewolf. It could be a vampire. No one knows. But meanwhile, it's like, Hi, I'm Bella yeah. and I'm 18 years old. And I love shopping and... <laughs> my friends and i just love my town no 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 but yeah i'm dating uh or, but this well, is, this is yeah bella, i've been in the dating scene before huh it's bella though. she's got no energy she has to be like yeah okay like yeah i've been in the dating scene before <laughs> but like is that what it is? now i'm trying to branch out to like some kind of kind of sexy occult person you know Flicks hair. So here we have on the show, this is Daniel. Daniel's a vampire. He loves sucking blood and going out for <laughs> long nights and long walks. T- tell us a little bit about yourself, Daniel. Oh, yes, I was born in the 18th century and I love uh, uh, science and my father. Who is not really my father, he's just a man who bit me. <laughs> Was a doctor, and still is, and a good one at that. Wow, thanks, Daniel. Now let's go over to Brandon. I don't know why I changed their names, but fuck it. Who's, Brandon. Who's Brand- uh, Brandon <laughs> Jacob? No, actually, he could just be the other random yeah. guy in there. Brandon the Wendigo. Uh, yeah, he's a Wendigo. <laughs> he loves to... Uh, what do Wendigos do? I don't know. I don't know. Eat niggas. Oh, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm in the deep end here, just like you. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I'm thinking. Oh, okay. I've got casting for him. Can okay. can it be um J- J- Julian Dennison? Oh, what I looked up. He's in. Deadpool two as he's, he's he's the oh yeah the little little dude yeah the, yeah sure little chubby man yeah he's just like <laughs> you're right mate I, I can't I can't do it in New Zealand actually here man yeah yeah I'm just here I I'm a Wendigo I I love I love eating people but don't worry about that because I'm just here to have a good time. make Bella love me <laughs> wow thanks Brandon now let's go over to yeah, Jacob. Jacob, right? Yeah, that's Jacob. the right one. Yeah, Jacob. 
Yeah. Oh, Jacob. Oh, can, can I do hey, Jacob? Hey, I'm do Jacob. Jacob. I'm a... Wa- oh, sorry. Yeah, oh, go for it. Hey, I'm Jacob Black. My fa- my family line is the Black Clan. We're one of the strongest and most revered werewolf clans in the area. W- wow! <laughs> It just cuts Sorry. to the audience, and it's like all his <laughs> mates in jean shorts, like holding signs. <laughs> just holding like... the shit. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, and then it cuts to Jacob, who's like, <laughs> <laughs> like just, Jacob's wearing. Okay, so, so Jacob still has his long hair, you know, like in the beginning of the franchise. Yeah. But he's like got it plaited, and it's like over one shoulder, so he looks dangerous. Mm-hmm. He's like, yeah. He's like, yeah, I don't know. Like, I, I feel like I'm different to the competition. Like, I feel like, and like, I, <laughs> I feel like Bella's had a lot of bad relationships and like, I know like we've only spoken like once or twice, but she loves me. She doesn't know it yet, but she loves me. And then it like cuts back to the Wow. Guy. There's <laughs> Jacob. That was great. No, let's get on to the show. <laughs> This is kind of turned more into a game show, but <laughs> a, bit, a little bit, a little yeah. bit. <laughs> but, well, we could ground it in reality. It's more like a uh, like a bachelorette type thing, bachelor, whatever that yeah. show's called. You know, when you like, yeah, oh, yeah. this rose for you, type thing. And now, so a they, word they're like in sponsors. these random situations. Oh yeah, <laughs> Rage honey, Shadow what Rage. are you doing in the other room? <laughs> Oh, I'm just making dinner. But while we're doing that, I'm playing on my phone. Yes, that's right. Raid Shadow Legends. We're Raid Shadow... By the way, we are not in any way affiliated with Raid Shadow Legends. I'm, I'm, I mean, if, just if, if they put want, that out there. I mean, this is all a bit. If they fair. want to, sure. But this is all a bit. So don't think we're making any money off of this. Because we're not. <laughs> anyway, here's Raid Shadow Legends. Wow, look at this fort we just built. Incredible. Very and nice. look at this unit we just pulled. Oh my god. Honey, how long's dinner gonna be? I don't know, but maybe we should play some more Raid Shadow Legends. Haha, uh-huh. Raid Shadow Legends. On all devices now. <laughs> Back to the show. Here I've got <laughs> Bella with me, ready for a lovely time. Bella! What's the first task, Bella? Well, uh, yeah. I wanna see who can wine and dine me best, so. I want you to cook a meal for me and see where you can take it. Right, boys. You heard her. Let's make some meals. I'm going to calm down. It just like, My mom's working in the other room. <laughs> like, I'm being really loud. It God just damn. cuts between all the people. So he's like, so, um, uh, <laughs> uh, I've written his name down. Daniel, what are you making? <laughs> well, like, I don't know. Like, I don't really subscribe to it food as it were like i like to see it more as prey i don't know um oh. i was kind of in the <laughs> i was kind of feeling maybe like some some like some some dough blood maybe finish it off with like a a nice little rabbit blood glaze i don't <laughs> know you know i, I just I, I i'll wait and i'll see whatever comes to me comes to me man you know food is food it's whatever nice Okay, moving Absolutely along here. Yes. <laughs> Brandon, what are you making? Me, hey man, I I just got uh, some a nice pangea with a uh, rip and uh, a little bit of fingers in there because you know a, a good finger can spice up any meal <laughs> and, and uh, any relationship. Maybe this finger. Oh yeah. <laughs> Now on to Jacob. Jacob. I keep forgetting their names. <laughs> He's the only one who has the same name as the film. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, um, me. What am I making? Oh, uh, uh, I'm making Bella pizza. Um, it was actually, it was, it was. Sorry, I don't. She, she just, she makes me so nervous. I don't know. I just. You know, he's like starts fiddling with his braid. He's like, like, yeah, I, I don't know. He's just, a, you got this, bro. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> still in the background. <laughs> We've just got like a sign. It's like he may be a wolf, but that's my dog or something. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> you got this, bro. Oh, 
Yeah. Thanks, bro. <laughs> 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 and then there's like a transition it's like and it cuts to Bella and she's like so yeah I just I, I thought this would be like a really interesting way because like I don't know like food like what's the point in enjoying it really like it's whatever like yeah like I kind of just eat it because like I don't want to die or whatever but I guess some like sustenance is better than others I guess we'll just see. Well, hold on there, Bella. Can we pan over to uh, Daniel? Daniel? He's got one of our camera crews by the neck. <laughs> and he just pans over him. He's just <laughs> fucking ripping out his throat and shit. <laughs> just like, he's just there, shrugs yeah. like, oh, it's for the meal or whatever. <laughs> just spits out. His I needed some B positive. <laughs> <laughs> like it's like the boom mic guy and he's just like twitching on the floor <laughs> <laughs> then it um, pans over to um, Brandon and he's just like like he burns himself on a thing and he gets really upset and he's like Rrr! and like turns into a wendigo and he's like bouncing around the kitchen like throwing <laughs> shit and the, like the, the host is just like uh, 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 cut to break cut to break dude <laughs> <laughs> Are you sick of staring at the same adverts? Why are you looking at adverts when you could be playing Raid Shadow Legends? I love Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> it's a great game where you can choose one of 18 champions and it's constantly updating. My personal favourite champion is Blorgor the Extreme. He's crazy. I like to <laughs> pillage through dungeons with him and even sometimes you can play online with friends. So what are you waiting for? Go download it now. Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends does not recommend that you go and pillage any real shelves anywhere. Cool, thank you. Bye. <laughs> Welcome back to the show. <laughs> now, all our contestants have the meals ready. Let's go to Bella to see what she thinks. First, she's going for Daniels. He made a... Whatever the hell he made, I can't remember. <laughs> Is there a name for it? Yeah, uh, d- 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 blood. <laughs> he made blood. <laughs> Let's see, Bella. What do you think? Oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah, yeah. It's, it's it's blood, and he's put it in like a in a in a in a sippy cup. <laughs> She's like, yeah, whatever. <sighs> Incredible. Why don't you try the next thing? Can't jet of fingers. Is it finger food? Who knows? Do we be pick up your hands? Whatever. <laughs> With you your just hands. try it. <laughs> <laughs> she tries that. Yeah, it's, it's, whatever. it's okay, I guess. It's whatever. And finally, on to Jacob. <gasps> Pizza. <laughs> from the bra. Hell yeah. Get it, bro. <laughs> it's whatever again. <laughs> and then, like, she goes to walk off, and he's like, "I, I, I, I Be- Bella, rem- remember, remember that one time when, when, when we bumped into each other at Papa John's, and and you were getting pizza, and I was like, hey, what pizza did you get? And and you said you got the, the barbecue chicken one because it's like whatever." That, that's why I made that for you. Ah, <laughs> Oh, um, yeah, sure. <laughs> I, I mean, if, if you actually look on the pizza and you look at the sauce, like on top, it kind of, it, it writes out uh, Jacob and Bella forever. Ah, Oh. Yeah, um, cool. So, was there any strong candidates there for you, Bella? Um, like, I don't know. Like, they were all, like, like, whatever. Like, yeah. Like, I don't know. Like, I, I appreciate the detail with the sippy cup. I thought that was a nice touch. Like, <gasps> there you have it, folks. Looks yeah. like Daniel took this round. Woo! All right, then. I guess we'll go on to the next game. 
contestant thing. I can I can think of the right word there. <laughs> Game contestant thing. <laughs> Sidekick. <laughs> uh, well, what do you mean? Like, like the next round? I guess so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So, um, like, I don't know. Um, I think it's really important to be able to just, like, look at each other, like, and not say anything. And just have really, like, you know? So, like, I don't know. I, like, want to see what is, what the, what the chemistry is like with the person. I just want to see how well they do just, like, staring at each other in silence. Yeah. So what the the contestants are all gonna stare at each other? No, 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 no. no. They're gonna stare at her, like they're gonna stare oh, okay. at each other and see like what their chemistry is like. Just <laughs> and if they're comfortable, just sitting in silence. And so like it, so it goes to Daniel first, and Daniel's just like, yeah, oh. just fucking licking his lips and shit. Yeah, he's like trying to hold back. He he wants it, but he. he as he can't cut to an interview with Bella yeah I thought it was weird he was constantly licking his lips but I don't know I guess like <laughs> being O negative is like rare or whatever so I get it if someone pulled out a bottle of 1963 Chateau Le Mans in front of me I'd be like young <laughs> <laughs> oh my like cuts to Brandon and he's just like <laughs> like bouncing off the walls and shit. <laughs> he's like Yeah, and then he goes to his interview, he's like, Yeah, I thought that went really well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's like, Yeah, I think our energies play off each other very well. Um yeah. Uh, she's a very fun girl to be around. I can't do it at all. This is better than mine. <laughs> I think yours is better. Hey man. No. Hey man. It's Korg. No. Hey man. Do you play really Shadow Legends on your phone? You got any games on your phone, Bella? Right, Shadow Legends. <laughs> it's like it's like Australian, but then if you put a little bit more upness to it, then it's more like this. Yeah, with a twing. Yeah, it's Australian with a twing. And everyone talks and every sentence ends at the end. Like this. Yeah. Then it cuts to Jacob. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, his name is Jacob, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and he's just, he's just looking at him, and he's like, hi, how are you? Yeah, oh, I don't know. Yeah, like, you've got really pretty eyes or whatever. Like, yeah. Yeah, no, like, cool. She's like, just rolling her eyes and stuff. He's like, buddy the elf. He's just like, yeah, so like, <laughs> so like, what's your favourite colour? It's what's your favourite colour? <laughs> Sorry. It that's cuts to an it. <laughs> Interview with his boys, <laughs> and they're just like, yeah. <laughs> what a guy! <laughs> Woo! So he always knows the right things to say. Jacob! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm like running around my room to to get like the distance and shit. Just... Yeah. <laughs> 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 and it's back to the announcer guy I guess he goes so Bell what did you think about that round she's like I don't know like I feel like I feel like I made Brandon kind of nervous like he, he had like a lot of manic energy and like but I don't know like I feel like we kind of go well together, maybe. I think he, his energy matched mine the best. I'd say maybe. But I don't know. It's whatever, you know. Yeah. Jacob. <sighs> Jacob's Jacob, you know. Like, I think we've had like one conversation before. Like, I actually think it's really weird that Jacob is like the only person I've met before this, and. It was me telling him that I'd signed up for this. And then the next day, he'd also <laughs> signed up for this. I don't know. 
but whatever. <laughs> and oh yeah, Daniel. <laughs> Daniel was just like, like where was the energy? Like, he was probably the one most comfortable with like being silent, but I don't know. Like, it just didn't even feel like he wanted me for me. He just wanted me for my blood. You know, I was like, uh, like what do you want from me? Ah. Uh. Well, that sounds excellent. <laughs> Stick around, folks, because after the break, we've got the final round. Now, a word from our sponsor. Colonel, this is a distress call from Group GD68. We've been stranded out here for several months. The only thing that's kept us sane is Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> Raid Shadow Legends is an epic online game where you can raid... Uh, get new units and play to your heart's content. It keeps me sane, and it'll keep you sane back on the battlefield. Download Rage Le Shadow Legends now. Use code REAL for 60% off one of your first summons. Hey folks, welcome back to Twilight. So... Last round, we saw Bella and the boys take on an epic staring contest. Well, maybe it wasn't a staring contest. It was just more of a comfortable silence thing. But whatever. Now, for the final round, we've set this one up. This isn't go what going to be what Bella's chose. We've done this to make the show more interesting. Yeah. What? What's the What's the thing? <laughs> I don't really have anything in my head. I, I thought maybe like they did a total wipeout type thing, but that was like a complete tonal shift. Yeah. Not that the tone of this hasn't been wild already, but I don't know. I, 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 you know I can't see the boys from Twilight I say, and Brandon. I say commit Julian to it. Denson. No, no, I, I say yeah. we, we make it, it's like a, it's like an obstacle course kind of thing and they all have to race against each other. And like Bella's sat at the end, and whoever wins has to like propose to her. Yeah. So like you know, fucking uh, the total wipeout. Yeah. It's got like they're on the last course, and they like slide down that massive slide and shit. Yeah. They're all like kind of doing that together, sort of thing. But it's like in so they so. It, the guy takes you around the course. He's like, so first we've got the slide into the massive pool of blood that's sure to take Daniel out of the game quickly. He might sit there and slurp it up. Then we have the punching wall, but instead of boxing gloves, they're <laughs> knives. And then once they get past that, they got to run through the field of hot coal. Yeah, if they stick around on that for too long, their feet might burn. <laughs> Next, they have to climb the massive ladder. Which is also knives. Yeah. <laughs> and then they gotta jump over the crazy balls, which have, if they pop them, then snakes fly out and they can <laughs> tangle you up and drag it down. And and then. Ooh, ooh, I've got one, I've got one. And then go, they, go. They have to run across like the minefield, but you, you have to be like careful with it because if you trigger a mine, it will release either a, a big. Ba um, a big cloud of toxic um, uh, garlic t like smoke yeah mm -hmm. or if you step on like so so uh, there are three different like bad things it could be that you step on and like create the vetal trigger and each one is yeah. like specifically like against the, the I, them, yeah. yeah like like I don't uh, know what a wender goes for. maybe it's like they get distracted by shine oh it's fire it was fire so like okay Maybe one of them, like, if you step on it, it, like, sets your ass on fire. Um, another yeah. one is, like, a, a big toxic, um, like, garlic cloud. And, like, yes. the, the last yeah. one is, you know, like, one of those, like, ultra high frequency things that you use to keep, like, dogs and cats from shitting on your garden? Yeah. It's, like, one of those, <laughs> but, like, so powerful it makes your ears bleed. Oh, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> and then, finally... <clears throat> They've just got to do the walk to Bella. 
pretty simple enough stuff there. So our contestants are ready. Three, two, one. Raid Shadow Legends. Ooh. And he'll just fucking this run is... off. So I, uh, I reckon it starts how we think. Like um, Daniel ends up like stuck in the pool of blood for a while, and he's like, <laughs> yeah, slurping it all up. Yeah, like Augustus Gloop style. So then, um, <laughs> what's his name? But what I'm thinking is Brandon hasn't turned into a Wendigo yet. He's just like chilling as him. He's he's trying to be good, and so is Jacob. Yeah. But Jacob's converted to like his jean short, short hair, yeah, like look. So it's like the two of them. So like Jacob's like sprinting like the man he is, and like Julian Dennison's yeah. like, oh, need to speed up, man. And he's just like <laughs> hobbling along. Yeah. Um. But then, uh, so what's his name? So Jacob like sprints across the um, like the hot coals, and he's like, because ah! he's in like a lot of pain. And uh, that's one yeah. hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> and like, so maybe so Julian Dennison can only turn into a um, thing of a jigger, a, a wendo. Like he can't control when he turns into one. It's like if yeah. he gets like really annoyed or whatever. So like he's he's running, he's running, he's running, and. Then like he maybe he made like a little necklace charm that he was gonna give to her at the end, and like he's been showing this oh. the whole time. Yeah. Uh, and then like it f- comes off on one of the things, and he's like, <laughs> and turns into like a mega Wendigo, and then he's like flying around the course because he's like a little spider monkey thing, and he's just like, <laughs> and like, <laughs> and then this is where Jacob sees him catching up, so he turns into a wolf. Meanwhile. Uh, what's his name? Daniel's just finished the pool, and he's like looked up and he's like, "I <laughs> like super, <laughs> super fast vampire run." You know, like when they like run, it looks hella goofy, and it's like, <laughs> so like they're sprinting, ba 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 ba. So now it's all three of them; they're all neck and neck, and they get up to the big balls. Mm-hmm. Actually, no, 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 no. Yeah, so the other two have gone already. So Jacob's just been like balancing like a dog f- as a werewolf for some reason on the balls um and then yeah. what's his name um comes julian dennison brandon and like he just makes it in one leap but maybe he, yeah. he hits like the last one and it opens the snakes and then those snakes pop all the other ones so there's no way for what's yeah. his name to get across um so uh daniel he like takes a, a real run up and sprints and leaps into the air and turns into a bat and starts like oh. flapping his weird little wings. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> and he makes it to the other side, and all three of them touch down at about the same kind of time. Yeah, and he just and it, it just goes silent. The crowd is tense. Jacob, like all the all the boys in jean shorts are like biting their nails yeah <laughs> hey all of um all of daniel's really weird like albino looking um family are there too just like step they're barely blinking they're just like yes Be- bella's dad's in the audience and it, and it cuts to an interview with him he's like i don't know what the hell's going on here <laughs> <laughs> i just came because they said there'd be free popcorn <laughs> you could hear a pin drop. No one wants to make the first move. Daniel puts his foot out. Everyone freezes, but mine's been armed. Mm-hmm. But what is it? He sidesteps to the left quickly. <gasps> it blows up. There's like flames everywhere. So he like because he jumped so quickly he like rolls along the floor and pops back up as he's done this roll it's triggered like three other ones so like now all of the like the first layer are now like going off so the only option that the other two have is to jump in themselves oh so now it's all three of them they're jumping and they're bobbing and they're weaving and um uh, brandon who's like he's, he, when he turns into wendigo he probably dro- drops to probably like four foot five or something like that but he's like yeah. Really tough claws, really like iron teeth. He's like a little spider monkey. So he's like yeah. jumping on the backs of them and he's like, <laughs> and like, muting himself through the air. 
Jacob's just like, bah, 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 like as a wolf. Um, and uh, Daniel's just like, <laughs> like <laughs> bobbing in and out of places. And they all like jump. They're all jump. They, so what's his name? Um, where's his name? Brandon like leaps through the air to get there first. And they grab him and like yeet him back. But he lands on a mine, and the mine he lands on is like a fire one, and it makes him fly back forward through the air. No. Oh. And he gets like one of because his nails are so long. I, I may or may not have stole that from my hero because <laughs> his nails are so long. <laughs> um, his his nail is just about gets over the line first. Oh. And all three of them are just beat. They're tired. Maybe Daniel da- Daniel had way too much blood as well, so he's not like operating at full capacity. He's full, yeah. Um, and they're all just laying there, tired and panting, and they're like, "So who wins?" And the host is like, "Well, you're not done yet. There's still the the climb." So, uh, <laughs> so what's his name? Um, Brandon's turned back into a human at this point. Uh, well, Jacob's run out of energy too so it's all it's just these three men clambering up these stairs willing themselves up there <sighs> and they all make it up at the same time and like what about now who's cool. who's the winner what, what do we do and Bella's just like like it's whatever like to be honest with you like I think I'm the the person I probably want to go with is like Daniel. Daniel, can you can you get your sister Alice to give me her number, please? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. God damn. Yeah, I don't know. Like she's pretty cool, I guess. It just cuts to Alice in the audience, and she's like, like blushing. She's like, oh. <laughs> this does make me feel some type of way. Um. Wow! What a twist! I didn't see that coming. Did you? Hmm. What about next week, where we have another girl from some Twilight ripoff? I don't know. Let's call her Decca. And she's going for a lion man. Uh, <laughs> um. A, a dragon boy, and. A 70-year-old retired vet. <laughs> Tune in next week. <laughs> and we'll... It's sure to be a humdinger of a show. <laughs> now, a final word from our sponsor. It's like, you can just hear Jacob crying in the background as the show ends. Uh-huh. Don't worry about it, bro. Uh-huh. You're too good for her anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, I have it. It's in my hands. The key to destroying the world. At last, reality can be whatever I want it to be. With new Raid (laughs) Chef. Oh my god. (laughs) I think that's a good place to call it then. Because that was there was a lot of manic energy in there that today. Was so much manic energy in there. <laughs> I also I don't really think we did it oh as a God. TLC show. I, I think it, no, it's it just... started and then it just turned it into like a total wipeout dating show. Yeah, bloody hell. That reminds me though of the very first episode where we just didn't know where we were going with it. <laughs> And we were just, and we were just like, yeah, they just all go to a machine. <laughs> God it's like, damn. It's like when a kid tells a story and they're like, and then, and then, and then, <laughs> and, and then, and, and then a tank, a tank blows her up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a big tank. <laughs> go to us. I think, so, yeah. yeah. What a great episode. Uh, <laughs> uh, a, a complete shift from the last uh, couple of weeks where they've been like fairly grounded I feel like the more you go back the the less grounded it becomes 
Yeah. But let's say from uh from the Muppet episode to now, it was like sort of grounded, but how grounded could you get with the Muppets? Then it was like, oh damn, this is this is serious business. <laughs> and it got a little bit iffy to the end. But but, but you and see- then like <laughs> last week, Sto- Scooby Doo is like it's, it's as grounded as Scooby Doo can get. And now this was just like. This fucking happens. There's a werewolf bitch and the fucking dating him and, uh, and, a, and a New so Zealand. This man is as a... it's straight as far from the source material as it can get. The only things that stayed the same was their Jacob the werewolves and vampires, and they had Bella and Jacob, had a dad, and the uh, the sister. <laughs> oh, crazy. But yeah, that's been another episode of reinventing the real. Mm. I've been Cameron. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just eating some Nando's Peronese. I've been Curtis. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. And I'll see you next week. (laughs) See you next week, man.